Yo, welcome back to the channel, it's your boy Cash, and today I'm bringing you a new YouTube video. As you can see, we're not in the studio, the YouTube studio that I have set up at the house. We're currently in the kitchen, also known as La Cocina. Um, I'm really excited about this video today because one, it's a change of environment, and there's a few things that I wanna to talk to you about in this video. If you're new to the channel, please check out some of the content that I've posted in the previous videos. If you enjoy what I make, go ahead and subscribe and be a part of the community, and we'll keep growing this thing together. As you can already see, like the kitchen is not completed. We currently have the countertops in, uh, missing backsplash at the moment and fixtures. The refrigerator is not there currently. The refrigerator is right here to my right. So things are definitely unorganized. And if you can see the madness that's just behind the camera right now, it is looking real crazy in the house right now. So currently we're doing a remodel throughout majority of the house, but the emphasis of the videos that I'm creating is gonna emphasize on the kitchen, maybe a master bathroom. It just depends on how much I feel like I should share on the internet. Um, but the exciting thing about doing this video and just the remodeling process is, one, you actually get to feel like you're on HGTV to a certain extent. Um, so HGT, if you're watching, yo, sponsor your boy. And the second thing that's at least most exciting to me through the remodeling process is the before and after pictures. Seeing what this house used to look like before in regards to the interior, um, to where it's coming to its full fruition currently. And it looks amazing in its current state. And I can't wait to see how this project comes all the way through from start to finish. So one thing that I've always wanted to do with my YouTube channel specifically is to put out the food that I create. Um, with the previous kitchen, I did manage to make some videos that showcase that, and that was primarily during my plant-based journey. However, like, I wouldn't really feel in the vibes or the aesthetics if I'm just being honest with you guys of the kitchen because it's probably been in that current state for maybe like 20 years or so, I would say. What stands out for me is that being in this new atmosphere that the kitchen is currently providing, really drives home that creative energy to make something new, like new dishes, new smoothies, new juices, just kind of like new recipes that I can share with you guys that I engage and eat on my day-to-day -day basis. And hopefully that might help you accomplish like your fitness goals when I get back to those types of videos. So I'm really excited about that. I'm thinking about what I eat in a day, how much protein I consume in a day, what is my calorie intake, how to track macros, um, even like maybe there's holiday dishes or what am I cooking for my birthday or just things around that nature. So I bring up all this information because if you have any additional ideas of what type of content you want to see me make outside of the ideas that I'm already having, go ahead and leave that information in the comment section because I will be looking into those uh, tips and ideas of like what type of food, um, pretty much anything's on the table. So I don't want you to feel like, oh, it has to be like, something plant-based uh it could be something plant-based because i still know how to make that stuff but uh chicken fish um lamb just whatever like i just have a lot of ideas and i can't wait to start putting together like some cinematic culinary videos because man the stage is set <clears throat> like the backdrop is set now it's just like let's just make these videos and have fun and express ourselves and uh, see what we come up with together Last thing that I'll mention in this video, if you wanna drop some ideas as far as how we wrap up the kitchen currently, and of course I will be making a before and after video of this entire process, so it's been a lot of footage that I've been recording, but if you have any ideas on what type of finishes you think we should go with, um, gold or silver, if you have any ideas on what type of backsplash we should go with, I'll show you one of the backsplash options that we're currently looking at. I don't think it's gonna be the final one that we pick or select. However, um, it's just in the current state of, what, of things that we're looking at. Um, and lastly, oh, the wall color. <laughs> like we're looking at between designer gray, pewter gray. Uh, man, there's like so many, look, I'm gonna just show you this. There's so many different undertones of gray to select from. So if you have any favorite colors that could potentially go with this to make the cabinets pop, 
Um, leave that in the comment section as well. But the general idea of today's video is that we're getting back to cooking. We're getting back in the kitchen. We're gonna be chefing some stuff up. Man, like my grandmother taught me how to cook and uh, there's just gonna be like so many things that I feel like I can express at this point in my life. And uh, yeah, see what y'all think about it. Y'all might cook something yourself and you know, have this for y'all fam. And uh, hey, we're about to enjoy this. So. Thank you for watching the video. If you made it to this part, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Share this with a friend and I'll see you in the next one. Peace, light, and love. Let's get to it. As you can see, we're starting to come up on the backsplash. Look at the colors, the grays, a little bit of warmth in there. Maybe we can use that to pull out some of the gold tones. This is a better angle here. So you see this plank here, that's gonna be our floor. Potential backsplash option. Um, it's not a strong favorite, it's just here at the moment because this is what the interior designer from floor and decor provided for us countertop as you can see and you've already seen the cabinets cabinets floor some type of gray backsplash floor and then we just have to figure out the wall color <laughs> uh, interesting